Hey guys, it's Emery here at Homestead Horsemanship, and we are getting ready to head down to the big arena down at Grandma and Grandpa's with Natty. We're going to let her go, uh, stretch her legs, and play. She's been in the barn here in quarantine, mostly in the round pen, so she's had plenty of room to walk around and stretch. But she's only 10 months old, and a little filly like that has a lot of energy at that age, so I'm sure she is getting antsy and needing to run around. So we're going to head down there in just a little bit. Um, but I wanted to go over um, a couple comments, not a couple, quite a few comments that we have been seeing asking if Natty and Oliver have been, have met yet. Answer is no, they haven't really met. Uh, Oliver did walk by her the other day. Um, JR was taking him to the stall, but they didn't pay much uh, mind to each other, but they haven't actually met face to face. I think a lot of people have in their head that Oliver and Natty will be staying together. Well, Oliver is a stallion and Natty is coming up here on a year old. Um, so technically she could come in heat any day. And that's just not going to work right now. Natty is way too young to have a full, although nature says different and it could happen if she was in with a stallion. Um, so for the time being, for quite a while, Oliver and Natty will not be sharing a pasture. Natty will go out with the herd here um, after she's done with quarantine and she'll stay out there with the herd. So she'll have a lot of buddies. She's got a lot of foals out there that are close to her age. So she'll be good. Um, the other question in the comments that we're seeing is, are we keeping the name Natty? And the answer is yes, we are keeping Natty as her name. Uh, it just kind of fell into place at the sale. We started calling her Natty when she got here, you know, we were saying here, you know, Natty's here. <laughs> um, so it's just Natty. Natty is actually short for national. Um, her registered name is easy rocker national freedom. Okay. The other question in the comments, uh, is asking about Natty's weight, wondering if she is thin and she is thin, uh, for a full hair age. Um, although she is growing like crazy, getting tall so fast. Um, but if you go feel her, um, she's got the, a thick winter coat on. Uh, it's shedding off like crazy every day, but she's still, it's pretty thick and she's even thinner. You can feel like every bone in her rib cage. So, um, we have already done her first dewarmer. Um, we will do a follow-up dewarmer, um, sooner than later. And then she's getting all the hay she can eat, grain and water. And then here, once she's out of quarantine, we'll put her out with the herd and, uh, she'll get that fresh green grass and she should pile some weight on pretty quickly. Although she's growing at the same time so it could you know take a little bit um, to start seeing that weight uh, but as long as she's getting the, the nutrition that she needs um, she's gonna be perfectly fine and then the other thing before we head down to the arena to watch her play um, I actually found quite a few photos of um, her sire and dam and then a couple of her grandparents so I thought I'd show you guys uh, those photos really quick because I thought it was pretty cool to see Okay, as far as we know, this is Natty's mama. That's not Natty as a fool. Uh, that must be a sibling of Natty's. Uh, Natty's mama's name on the, uh, the registration papers is Valentine's Norma Jean. And then this is Natty's sire. His name is Stillbrooks Cherokee. He is really beautiful. And as far as we know, uh, both Natty's parents, sire and dam, are well over 18 hands tall. And then this is the grandsire on Natty's mama's side. Um, and we actually had the owner of this boy reach out to us uh, after we got Natty. So that was kind of cool. And he did say that this boy stood or stands at 18 hands, 2 inches. And then this is the grandsire on Natty's sire side. Absolutely beautiful horse. Um, I don't know much about him other than somebody sent us a photo. So if any of you out there um, know any more of Natty's relations, I'll put the papers up so you can kind of see see who's on there. Uh, we would love to see photos. Uh, so send them our way. Our email is in the description of the video. Natty has been cooped up for a while. She's been in our barn and then before we had her she was at the National Clydesdale sale as most of you know. So she was in a stall there. It was held at the Illinois State Fairgrounds. Um, it was a nice stall but small um, and so we thought she would just take off running and bucking but of course she didn't. She just went right to eating grass. I think she grazed for about 10 minutes before she finally realized she could run.
Get it, Natty. Get it. Hey. <laughs> Woohoo. Good job. Does that feel good? Watching Natty run like that, so graceful and with such ease, uh, makes you realize how uh, poor Oliver was when we got him, because he wasn't much older than her, you know, he wasn't even two yet when we got him, just a baby, so it makes you realize how bad he actually was and felt. Do you do check-ins or something? Uh-huh, I'm right here. Such a pretty girl. Yes, you are. Yeah. Okay, go play some more. Show off for us. Let's see you go. Let's see you go. Don't itch on that fence. Let's see you go. Natty is very much a people person or people horse. She wants to be right by us all the time. So after that first initial run, <laughs> uh, she Come just on, started staying Come right on. by the fence. She wouldn't go do anything, and it made it very difficult to film. <laughs> um, so eventually I walked away hoping that, you know, she would forget about us and kind of go do her own thing. Uh, and she started running around playing again, so that was sweet. Again. Natty really worked up a sweat. It was pretty hot out and humid, and plus she came from, you know, snow-covered ground, cold temperatures to uh, Missouri with its hot spring humid weather, and uh, she still has a full winter coat on where our horses already are Hi, all shut off for the year. Oh, you're so hot now. Settle down. Settle down. Good. Do you need an air conditioner? I think so. <laughs> Over the next few days while Natty's still in quarantine, she'll come down to the arena here and there to stretch her legs and run around and play. I think she really enjoyed it and she really needed out, so it was good for her. Before heading out, make sure to give Natty a thumbs up. She sure would appreciate it. And if you enjoy our videos, please consider hitting that subscribe button and turn on your <laughs> notification bell so that our videos are pulling up in your feed as soon as we release them.